if you're going to have a house in Oregon, if you're going to build any structure in Oregon, if you're going to look at any structure, if you're going to assess any structure in Oregon that is not on stilts, at some point or other, you're going to have to determine how to engineer the water away from the structure because there's so much water at certain times in the year in Oregon that it, uh, that it could really fuck you up on a basic construction level. Um, on the last job, you guys saw the gravel pit. And the truth of that matter is, is that it went from French drain plan to gravel pit plan back to French drain plan. And the reason it went back to French drain plan is because I just got this weird habit of hitting these old fucking drain lines when I'm digging a fucking gravel pit. So, here we are. This was supposed to be a gravel pit drain, but as usual, your boy Jason, the fucking water hound, hits the fucking old drain. So even though this is dug for a gravel pit, this is going to be just a regular fucking drain. So anyway, I was just showing you where I was at today and why I've had to make the decisions I had. It's just so funny because the last job, I dug a French drain and then I filled it back in. Then I dug a gravel pit, and then I ended up digging another French drain to go into the gravel pit. So here we go. We started with the gravel pit plan. But it's kind of alternated into a semi-French drain plan due to the discovery of an existing drain line. And that's pretty much all that's going on with me today. Um, well, I finally got this laurel stump out. So now I'm working on this one over here. But we'll talk about that another time.